Baby, it look like I'm ready for my ex's funeral. I remember I did like a video on Instagram and I had on this badass like black dress and I had said that child. The comments was hilarious. But anywho, hello, hello, hello. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to my channel. If you are new here, I am Daquana White. I bring you plus size fashion content as well as lifestyle and beauty content. So today we are getting into an ASOP haul. Per usual, every single week, I bring you guys these hauls. But lucky for you all, I'm going to be doing like a bunch of hauls today that I will be dropping sporadically throughout the rest of this week and early next week. So, and I have some vlog content and stuff like that. And even some hair content. So, I've been doing a little bit of everything, even though I be real silent sometimes. <laughs> so, I do have a coupon code with ASOP, which is D-White25. Everything that I try on will be linked down below everything that I try on is a 3x okay um I tell you guys if I would size up if I could or if I would size down all that good stuff I am 5'4 my measurements are on my site all labeled real nice graphed out for you so or charted out so please check that out it's always in the description as well dwlooks.com I also want to thank ASOP for being a sponsor of my brand I want to be where I offer courses planners merch and a brand ambassadorship program and I'm just super duper excited because I also just recently we're getting into housekeeping real quick okay, okay. we got a few more housekeeping a few more housekeeping <laughs> um I just launched my podcast the delicate dynamic so um I hope you guys check that out I'll link that down below as well and it'll always be in the descriptions of my videos i took my secondary channel and started to use it as my podcast channel because i already had it and i have an instagram for it as well we're available on spotify apple google amazon our heart radio anchor and i believe that's all <laughs> so yeah definitely check me out over on the delicate dynamic i'm super excited about that actually gonna record an episode tonight i believe since i'm already dressed if not i'll do it tomorrow because i'll be dressed tomorrow because me and babe are going on a date and i um also have some other filming like some shoots to do so today i'm doing my filming tomorrow i'm doing pictures so yeah let's go ahead and hop on in because i have blabbered enough here we have this First of all, it's super long, so the back touches the ground on me. I didn't know. I thought it could be really, really cute, and I still stand by that. Like, I love that the buttons are functional in the front. I love that you can wear it as a dress or as a shirt. I want to say there were other colors. Don't quote me on that. <laughs> Definitely check out the link down below to make sure. But, y'all, I think this is so cute. I love the ruffle detailing. I'll come up so you guys can see that. But... Yeah, I think it's really, really nice. I feel like it's sophisticated. It's that modest but sexy. Um, it is sheer. I have on black underneath, so you really can't see too much, but you can see like a little bit like it's sheer like in this area. But yeah, absolutely love this. I could have sized down like it's so much room in the sleeves. This is just a really roomy piece. I think, though, if I would have sized down, my buttons would have probably been looking like they were pulling. So I'm glad I did get a 3X. I'm, like, stepping on the back of it because it is really, really long. This is how it looks in the back. All right, and by the way, for my bottoms, I just have on, like, a simple black legging that I wore over here. ASOF does have these leggings or this type of legging as well with a thick waistband so yeah just so you guys know here we have this top and i'm gonna be mad because some of this stuff is a surprise to me and other things i just didn't know what i was getting to be honest this week i sent so many options over i had no clue so it's like a surprise and this here like the fits are actually a surprise for me because that last top I really didn't expect to like it. I like to try new things for you all, but I love it. And then this top here, I don't know, on the site, it was giving this. But when you get it on, it like gives something else. Like, it looks so much cuter in person. Um, and shout out to the young lady who tagged me over on TikTok who got that jacket. Fluffy, real fluffy pink top that I tried on last week. Y'all, I'm in love with it. I cannot wait to style it. I got this pink set here this week that's so fire as well. But back to this top. Love the material. It's not scuba. I know you girl, I know the girls. They don't like it. But um this material is actually like a it has sound to it. But I feel like when you're walking and you know, it doesn't really make too much noise. So I like that about it. This part here 
is really really stretchy so i appreciate that and it looks so good on and yeah i love this i actually kind of wanted it to be off the shoulder but i'm not mad at the on the shoulder either you know for me i just be like but my tattoo will be so cute because it has the red lips and it matched it so cute like so nicely so yeah that'd be my own like i'll be having my own reservations but anywho that is this here i like the drama i feel like it's just enough love this hanging over here and it is a zipper so i just wrapped it around and zipped it right over here along with the hook at the top so yeah that is this top here let me show you the back looks like this nice coverage in the back i want to especially shout out the young lady who was like oh my gosh you're not trying one of three eggs like that's not a three x i'm like but i am <laughs> like i'm trying on the three x's from asap well you're not a three x well babes that's why i try them if they don't work then they don't work i'll let you guys know that however anywho let's um put aside the negativity and get into this outfit because asap gonna always 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 do it for me like <laughs> every single week there's gonna be something that does it for me okay um this for this haul this whole haul it's about to be fire. I already feel it in my soul. But anywho, let's get into this pant. So I am a skeptic. Even after loving Aesop for so long, I just am a skeptic of faux leather. Typically, it does not work for me. So when I get it, immediately stretch. Oh, okay. Let's get into this. So I don't know if this one said high stretch or moderate stretch. Did see Amara with these on and she looked amazing. But I think she had them in a that might have been another leather pair because she did have one pair in like a 2x but she said she could have got a 1x and i'm like uh i don't know she wore it in the 2x like i don't know but this is a 3x in these bottoms and i love look at the fringe love that for me um definitely keeping these around paired it with this uh turtleneck it's not a mock neck it actually is like all the way up so comfortable so cute they had it in brown and i want to say maybe like a maroon i'm not sure now one thing if you are conscious about looking wider which i am not <laughs> but if you are conscious about looking wider the fringe going all the way up will you know add a little whiff to you but i think it's a fun wide like <laughs> it's not like oh my gosh that's just unflattering i think this actually looks really nice this, I would actually wear this together, okay? I could do a sneaker, I could do a heel, a booty, like, I love this. Now, the only thing about a booty is I feel like it'll take away from the fringe a little bit at the bottom, but that's neither here nor there. In love, in love. Asaf, y'all always have me keeping stuff that I don't need. My closet is full, and I literally got so much stuff to put in my closet. This is the back. You can see the pants come up nice and high love love oh one thing i forgot to mention i'm gonna untop the top for you all so you can see how long it is um because i just had it tucked in because that's how i would wear it but this is pull that back up the length of it so it's like halfway down the butt and that is how that looks there this just does not do it for me that's why it's very important to know how to dress your body because i know some people would shy away from you know tucking in a top because they don't like this tummy area but me doing that did absolutely nothing for me and having it tucked in just looked way better in my opinion either way that's this outfit let's go ahead and hop into the next one while i love this i can admit that it's not gonna work not i mean i can finesse it because i can definitely put a safety pin but you know i don't know I don't know if it'll hold up for real. But I will tell you, I think Amara was saying this, if I'm not mistaken, because when I did click on some of these pages, matter of fact, the title of this is going to be, the title of this video is going to be, I searched through all the pages so you won't have to, because I literally went through every single page on ASOS website when picking out items this week. This one was actually near the back. Like, it wasn't even in the front, but this is gorgeous. Like, how did I miss this? <laughs> how did I miss this when it was a new arrival? Because I don't feel like it's new anymore. I could be mistaken. However, you can see here, it doesn't quite work. Unless I just sold that up, it won't work for me. <laughs> like, it won't work for me. And I would, like, have to sew myself into the dress because I don't think it'll be able to work if it's sold and me trying to put it over my head or step into it. So, it's like a catch-22. <laughs> doesn't quite work for me. I will say the structure of the dress is beautiful. The buttons are extremely strong and they're not like the 
manual buttons they are snap buttons so that makes it even freaking better color gorgeous can what can i do though i can put on uh my beige cami underneath that matches this perfectly so that you wouldn't see the gap in or i could put on a belt so i might be able to finesse this I might be able to finesse it. I might. I might. Okay. So in the back, depending on how long it is, I may or may not finesse it. This is the length of it back here. But what I love is like, oh, my hair might be in the way. What I love is that peekaboo roll action we got going on. Like that is so, so cute. Don't want to take too much away from the bottom, but I will have on tights when I wear this. But I love this like lace up detailing underneath the flap super duper cute stop playing stop playing so here we have this jumpsuit and then we're gonna get into some sets i think i have about three sets for you all that i think y'all gonna love but this jumpsuit is so freaking fun it's so lightweight it's very very stretchy it's sheer so keep that in mind i have on black um a black thong and then like a black barely there bra so that's why it looks like, you know, I ain't really got nothing now. But this right here, I love the colors. It's so, so fun. Another thing that I found, like, towards the middle or the back of the pages, definitely something I could zip up by myself. I had it all the way down by the butt, and then I zipped it up by myself. Y'all know I love that for me. I saw somebody comment was like, oh, you can just get a friend to do it. Like, da-da-da-da-da, it's not that big of a deal. Well, when I'm at work at my office, I don't have a friend, <laughs> you know. Well, my friend actually is in this area. But, you know, I'm not just going to call her like, girl, come zip this so I can film it. Like, <laughs> no, I'm just going to show it to y'all how I show it to y'all. And if I was going to wear it, then I would get a friend to zip it up. Or I would get my girlfriend or my aunt or whoever I'm going out with. But that's neither here nor there. Here we have this jumpsuit once again. Love the colors. Love the fit. It's beautiful. I feel like you could even do something where you kind of crisscross the strings. And I'll come back and show y'all because I'm going to show it on TikTok how I do it. And come back and show y'all how it looks. But yeah. This. This is cute. I like it. It's comfortable as well. That's one thing. I would personally wear this to like, you know how we would be having like the parades and carnival and all of that. I feel like this would be really cute for that. You're showing skin, you're showing body, yaddy, yaddy. It's sheer. Like, I love this. Then you have the back again. Zipped it all the way from the bottom to the top. So that's how that's looking back there. It does lose a little, like it fades out a little bit around the booty because it's getting stretched right there but um i don't mind i don't mind i think it's super cute all right so i told you i was gonna come show y'all the crisscrossing i think this is cute as well it definitely gives it a different look so what i did was i took this one tied it to this one took this one tied it to this one instead of going just across and across and i think that's really really cute so love this for me all right so here we have this super pretty textured two-piece set so what i did was had it tucked in here because I thought it looked a little better and framed me a little better. But y'all, this is everything. I don't know if y'all are getting the texture. Look at the texture of it all. So one thing I love about this is how vibrant it is. I think that's gorgeous. But y'all, okay, in the mirror, can y'all see? Like, that's the true color the lights and stuff the camera is making it looks like a little more neon than what it is but this is a true pink color of it beautiful you could do pops of color for your accessories whatever the case is stretch phenomenal <laughs> i feel like the top i could have size down but i'm cool with the 3x because i definitely couldn't get a size down in the skirt without it taking completely away from the texture of it so it has like this puffer like puffed up texture which is really really cute but in my stomach and butt area it's not showing that for me it's just giving like a rouged or a scrunched or a smocked feel but at the bottom of it you can see where it goes back to being like a little puffy but other than that like this is gorgeous i don't have any shapewear on i have like i told y'all a thong and a barely there bra so this looks Amaze balls on feels really good and I cannot wait to style this. I don't know what pop color I'm gonna do, but I'm gonna do something. This is how it looks in the back. So I actually think this was one of my surprise pieces because I literally 
don't remember picking this out but if i did it's gorgeous i don't remember how the model had it tied in the front or in the back i don't remember but i tied it in the back I love this. The top separately is beautiful. The skirt separately is beautiful. I feel like I like that they played with the orange in the skirt and didn't make it too matchy matchy. Um, I love that they didn't go with like the purple or the pink in the skirt. I would love um, love to have seen this like blue color as well. I think that would have been gorgeous. But I kind of like the orange. I like the orange. I think it complements the purple really well. It's probably why they did it. But yeah, y'all, this is so comfortable. It's like a slinky feel. Um, I don't know if I'll wear these two pieces together. Even though I like it, like to my eye, it looks really, really good. I think I would take this skirt and dress it up. I definitely have been holding on to like the fun skirts from ASOP, the fun pants and putting them, you know, to the side so I can dress it up however I want, especially in the fall. I feel like we can really start to put on so many layers and forget like color and print and things like that so i could put on a fun pant pull out a turtleneck like a vest like there's so many different possibilities so um again i absolutely love this together but i would probably wear it separately as well this is how it looks in the back and i love like the slight mermaid flare of the skirt it's not overly stated it's not overly done but it kind of does just enough before the light came back up that was a true color they are deeper and more saturated in person but that is this two-piece set here y'all we are literally in the this hall with a banger so this one here it took me to futuristic star wars star trek all of them you know all the futuristic type stuff i don't know which one was which but this oh my goodness I could see myself in this on New Year's. Now, I, I'm lost for words. So, I've been trying on, like, a lot of sparkly stuff because as soon as we get to the winter, like, we automatically, well, my channel, we automatically start seeing, like, sparkly. And I'm like, I need it, I need it, I need it. At this point, I've tried a sparkly two-piece pantsuit, a sparkly blazer. I feel like I had a maybe shorter skirt set, but I'm not sure. Now we have this longer one, which is gorgeous. It almost looks liquidy, but this is all like a sequin type vibe. Not like um, 3D, but like a flat sequin, and I love it. Now, I like how the top fits. I thought it would be like a little bit too big, but it's like perfect. I like how the skirt, I like how long it is. Let's say that. I would definitely put on a legging underneath because I feel like, you know, just for a little more smoothing, I think that would look real good. And yeah, I don't know where I'm wearing this too, but I need it. I would wear them separately as well. Like I would wear this top with like maybe a black pant and a silver boot with the silver bag. Stop playing. So anywho, um, that is this two-piece set. It is stretchy. That's what I wanted to mention. The material, I've tried things where it was like itchy because it's stretchy, but this actually feels good. And I think it's because in the back, it's black. That's another thing I really like about it. The whole entire back of the set is black and it is smooth. I'm glad they didn't go with like a silver or a gray. I think the black brings a little something to it. And for me, makes it a little more futuristic. But it's like I'm doing the most, but it's just enough of the most. It's not over the top, but it's kind of over the top. Like, I don't know. I think the black kind of brings it back down a tad bit. So that concludes my ASOP haul for this week. I'm actually, it's Wednesday, y'all. Wednesday is my usual filming day. So let me know how your week has been going. Comment your favorite piece down below. That coupon code is D-Y25, but check if ASOP is having a sale first because typically they are and sometimes it's more off than my code. What else? Yeah, check out my new podcast, The Delicate Dynamic. I'll link that down below. I'll have all the links to everything I tried down below and let me know your favorite piece.